key feature of this treatment is that the stem cells can do two things at once. They can treat the cancer and they can regenerate the bones at the same time. Yeah, I think this therapy really paves the way towards like clinical studies where we can really easily engineer stem cell in any type of facility because all the reagents are already IFD approved and it's fairly easy to do so by any technician um, and we can also use different type of factor we don't have to use those specific factor but we can also fine tune those factor for the type of cancer uh, because we're using cells that can find the cancer we're delivering drugs directly to the cancer so you don't need to give the patient a large dose of chemotherapy which is very toxic so in that way, it helps to prevent toxins. Compared to standard of care therapy like 5 fluoracil that is a very nasty treatment that cancer patients really hate, this type of approach helps to limit the side effects because we deliver a prodrug that is not going to be harmful to the rest of the body but only going to be converted into an active drug like the 5 fluoracil on the cancer side, therefore limiting the side effect for the patient that is going to suffer less from the toxicity associated to those chemotherapeutic treatments. Uh, these stem cells also get cleared out of the body very quickly, within a few days, so there's no risk of them growing into a tumor or anything else that's associated with the cells.